Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying uh, six items, six candies from Sugarfina. Liz surprised us. My friend Liz in Ohio, she surprised us and uh, she sent us this gift box of Sugarfina. Uh, she has sent us Sugarfina in the past, so if you're interested, just type in Tammy Dunn Sugarfina and you, that should pop up. You'll see it. Uh, this is a, a gift set of four. However, they sent us two free samples. So the free samples are uh, Sugarfina and Corona Light. And this is dark chocolate sea salt caramels. And then do you want to tell what's in the box? Um, we got Aphrodite strawberry, dark chocolate marshmallow eggs, hearts of fire, and sparkle pops. So I figured first we would try the free samples. Uh, because there will not be a picture of these at the end because they're going to be gone. <laughs> uh, you get one. This is gonna be like a long. You get yes, you get one, and and so we're gonna half it and try it. This is the uh, sugar peanut and Corona Light. It says meet our new partner in Lime. Transport your taste buds to a beachside paradise one lime at a time with these tart, zesty lime slices. They look like a little slice of lime. Sugar, introducing Sugar Fina and the Light Cerveza. It's tough, a tougher jelly. Mmm. Very limey. I love that lime flavor. I don't know where the chroma comes in, but it's, very, it's just lime. I know. I do not Super. taste the Corona Light at all. All not that, that, I, know all that I taste is lime. Yeah. It's like a lime jello. It's very tough, but I like it because it would last a while. It'd be chewing off for a while. Yeah. <laughs> okay. This one, that's that's that one's very good. If you like lime, that would be one to try. Um this one, it says fall in love with our rich and dreamy dark chocolate sea salt caramels. It's no secret that these are our best-selling chocolate candies. These ultra-fine dark chocolates have the perfect amount of sea salt for a rich, delicious treat. It's tiny. It's good. It's dark chocolate. I didn't really taste sea salt, but... I love the flavor of the caramel. Mm -hmm. It's good. It's more of a chocolate than anything. I got the salt. Did you? You no. know how you get, get that piece of salt that... Like attaches your... itself to your tooth. That's what I got. Yeah. I think if you had been able to eat the whole thing, you oh, definitely would have gotten yeah. it. But since we halved one, I mean, it yeah. was one small piece. I think I got it all. Yeah, you got it. That was delicious. Absolutely delicious. It's good. Yeah. That really would be good. one worth ordering if you ever check them out. Yeah. So what do you want to try first? I think the gummy. The hearts of fire. Mm -hmm. I got a knife out so I can just cut these. These boxes, I love how they're displayed, number one, in the box. Uh, but these clear boxes, uh, you can keep them and put whatever you want in them. Just take the sticker off and you can keep the clear box. You think they're all the same? I don't. I got a, I got a white. I don't a know. Because, let me, well, let me read what it says and we'll see. Because I can see the three, three different ones. Hearts of Fire, these gummies start out sweet, then surprise you with a fiery kick of all natural ginger and spice. So do They're made in Germany. Nine pieces are 134 calories. Well, I'm trying this one, the light color. I think you missed this one. I don't know if you got one of those in there. Do you want to try, try two different ones? Yeah, they're pretty tough gummies. Oh, wow. Got some heat to them. Wow. And now you get to try another one just to make sure it's the same thing. <sighs> Whoop! I don't think I'd be able to taste it. Ooh. It's different. It was different. It does taste different. I don't want to eat another one. It does seem like it's, it, um, sorry, I'm digging in the bottom. Ooh. That, um, I don't know. It doesn't taste that. The fruit tasted different. Yeah, the fruit part, but not the hot part. Oh no, the hot part just burned your mouth. Yeah, 
the fruit part it does i mean because the one it's supposed to be ginger and it might have ginger in the next one but it, it seemed like that uh the fruit one of them was different than the other but then it the the flavors taken over uh by that heat yeah it just burns you up but now Ooh. i don't mind that i wouldn't want it all the time like i wouldn't eat this in one sitting or anything like i have gummies before yeah, just a um, couple of those all right but yeah if you had one and you were able to take your time with it then uh you would really enjoy those i i thought those were good what are these these are aphrodite strawberry and I, they're so i don't think we're going to be able to you'll have to uh, Let me see that quiet. Quiet these are now these hearts of fire were made in germany these are made in greece candied greek strawberries are dipped in sumptuous milk chocolate and mm -hmm. dressed in a speckled sugar shell you want your own okay. i didn't cut one for the picture but we want to eat your own these are good I don't know if I would have said they're strawberry, but they're good. Did I say the calories for these? I don't think so. The Hearts of Fire, um, three pieces, no, that's wrong. Nine pieces are 134 calories. The strawberries, four pieces are 170 calories. Those are delicious. They're very good. You get the little seeds from the strawberry. I right? love the strawberry in the center. I love the candy shell. I love the crunch of the outside. Mm -hmm. And then the the strawberry wasn't, it was firm, but mm -hmm. it wasn't hard. Right. Oh, it was delicious. It wasn't like a dried strawberry. No, that was delicious. That's Do you want to try the dark chocolate marshmallow egg? Sure. The other one is like popping candy. Okay. Pick one out. Okay, these are dark chocolate marshmallow eggs made in the USA. Dark chocolate marshmallow eggs, a fluffy vanilla marshmallow is dipped in rich dark chocolate and a crunchy candy shell. Nine pieces are 190 calories. You have mostly dark chocolate. You get the texture of the marshmallow, but you don't really taste the marshmallow. Mm -mm. They're still really good, though. Mm. Did you get a lot of vanilla in that, though? No, it's all chocolate. Because this says a fluffy vanilla marshmallow. Yeah, that's I don't get the vanilla. The dark chocolate. Right. If they had put it in milk chocolate, I think you would have been able to taste that vanilla flavor. Right. But you don't because they covered it up in dark chocolate. It's good dark chocolate, and I do like the crunch of it, but you don't taste marshmallow no. in that. Okay. And this one. Sparkle Pop. Something like that. Is mm. Sparkle Pops. Yeah, uh, these crunchy chocolates are filled with popping candy for a big burst of sparkle and pop. They're made in turkey. Like a, a malted milk pop. Mm hmm. Can you get that popping candy? That's cool. It right. tastes like a, it, it's the texture of a malt in ball, but it doesn't have that flavor of the malt. Mm -mm. I like that a lot. Yeah. Look at just a chocolate covered, crunchy chocolate ball with popping stuff. These would be good for kids. They're good for me because they mm. shut me up. <laughs> <laughs> They're good. All of kids would want to go. <laughs> Which one was your favorite? Uh, I definitely have a probably favorite. Probably the strawberry. Uh, the strawberry is my favorite too. Yeah. That is delicious. I'm telling you, the texture of it, everything was perfect about that strawberry. Now, at least there was probably the hearts just because it's so hot that you can't even, you can't really enjoy it. Okay. Because I um, wish I'll they agree had, with you. I wish they had a little bit more, a little less heat. I know they're hot. They're supposed to be hot. But I wish they had a little less heat so you would enjoy the, the flavor of the actual fruit heart right i understand that i think they wanted something different we are not big heat in our candy people yeah 
So like, like they the came Tabasco out, chocolate and, right? And they came up with the like the Skittles. I think did the yeah, hot fire, and the yeah. the, the, the uh, Starburst did the hot ones. We're just not. We want sweet with our sweet. So, but a lot of people like that. If mm -hmm. you like that, you would love these. Oh, yeah. um, my favorite was the strawberry, like mm -hmm. yours, and then I like the sparkle pops yep. next, and then the dark chocolate marshmallow yep. eggs, and then the hearts of fire. Yeah. But they're all good. They're all good um, quality. Yes, very, very good quality uh, candies. I would definitely, if you know, if you can afford it, um, I would go to their website, look around, uh, sugarfina.com, uh, and see what they have to offer because you can have make up your own box set. Uh, they have box sets with many, many flavors. Um, so they have so much to choose from. It's amazing. So thank you very much to Liz for sending us these. We really appreciate it. Um, I'll have a picture for you at the end and thanks for watching.